Morning class five. This morning we're going to make some ice cream smoothies or uh, milkshakes, whatever you prefer to call them. I'll call them a ice cream milkshake. Okay, so we're going to need one of these tumblers. I've got ice cream, I've got new Neapolitan. It's strawberry, vanilla, or chocolate. It depends on the variety of your house. Some might like chocolate, some might like vanilla, and some might like strawberry. We're going to go for the chocolate today because most people have a sweet teeth and they do like a bit of chocolate. So this is a good alternative. So we'll start with the ice cream. Process, if we put loads of chocolate ice cream inside the maker. This is really nice on a sunny day. This is yummy, yummy. Loads of chocolate ice cream for the children. That's enough. That's about 300 ml. It looks a bit more because it's not properly crushed. So then we're going to have a bit of chocolate powder to make it more strengthened. Okay, so I'm going to use this spoon. The one teaspoon is enough. A spoon, whatever you prefer. So we'll sprinkle that on. Yeah. And then we'll have some milk. So the same thing before, a glass of milk. But you can gauge it roughly for it so you don't overload it. That should be perfect, it's about 300 ml. And that won't overflow then. So what we'll do, we'll put the lid on. Stuff to the side so we don't have accidents. And like I said before, if the children's not used to the noise or doesn't like the noise, they can always wear ear protectors. My mum and dad could do that little process for them. Give that nice shake. And then we'll open. I'm just going to go and get a glass. And then you can see the strawberry milkshake. The strawberry milkshake, that's just the same. One person, you can have a glass, but if you're making it for the family, you can have a nice big tumbler. So we're going to go for the glass. If you have straws, I re recommend a straw so the teeth doesn't get cold. And that is a chocolate milkshake ready to drink, nice and cold. Mm. Delicious. Cheers. Bye, class five.